Yeah, it was very emotional. I mean, um, some of the songs, not all of the songs, some of the songs were just, um, it, 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 it took a, it, I mean, some songs you write in like five minutes and you're like, oh, great, you know? But some songs I just take a lifetime to write. And it's just because you go through the things in life that enable you to write these songs. And, um, you know, I don't think I could have written as emotional music uh, that's on this album, which I wrote, you know, even three, four years ago. I mean, I couldn't have done it just because I, 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 I couldn't, I couldn't, I, I mean, it, it's a different, it's a different time, right? You know, one of my favorite musicians, Steve Vai, he says when he, when he, when he listens to his old album, his first album, Passion and Warfare, he, he listens to it and he goes, you know, who was that kid? You know, who was that kid who was writing all that music? Because um, when, when you record music, it's, it's your life, it's your creativity in that moment, in that, in that, in that, in that time frame, you know, and, um, and that's why people follow bands, you know, that's why I follow certain bands, like, like Evergrey, you know, there's a story, there's a, there's, there's, there's a continuation, you know, and uh, sometimes, you know, like, sometimes, when a band reaches the end of the story, they they just they just give up. I mean, if you look at Led Zeppelin, they were saying a story, man. All the songs were stories, and after that drummer died, John Bonham, they split. They said, you know, I mean, uh, Phil Collins auditioned for them, Dave Grohl auditioned for them, and they were like, you know, you guys are great drummers, but you're not our friend. You're not our friend who you know wrote music with us, you know, for so so many years. And then it was it wasn't until um, their reunion concert, I think it was 2000 and something, where John Bonham, the original drummer's son, went on the drum kit and drum for Led Zeppelin. It wasn't until then that they had a proper reunion. 